Hey RebelEM followers, Salim Razai here, and on today's video we're going to talk about D5 versus D10 versus D20 and how to make it simple so you know exactly how much glucose you're giving your patient. Now I'm going to have this for all subscribers on the YouTube channel, but for subscribers who haven't chosen a membership yet, I just wanted to show you how you go about becoming a member because this is exactly what we're doing on the members page. So this is a picture of my YouTube channel. And if you actually look up in your top right corner, you'll see this join button. And if you click that join button, it's gonna give you three options, silver, gold, or platinum. And you can see that the cost is very nominal. It's 99 cents for silver, it's $1.99 for gold, and it's 2.99 for platinum. Now what do each of these things get you? So silver will get you members only polls like the one I'm about to share. Now if you choose to do the gold, you not only get everything that silver offers, but you get early access to videos I've uploaded and not published yet. You get exclusive members only videos, which usually I'm explaining what the reasoning is for the polls that we're putting out there. And then if you choose to go platinum, you get everything silver and gold give you, but we're also going to start doing some live streams about four times a year where we go through some clinical conundrums and we get some experts on here so that we can get their input in terms of how they would manage some of these difficult patients that we all see. So enough about that. So the poll I put out is, this might be a silly question, but running D5W at 150 cc's an hour gives you about how many grams of glucose per hour? I posted this on X, which used to be called Twitter, and you can see we got about 793 votes, and almost just over 75% of people got the answer correct, 7.5 grams. But there was still about a quarter of people who quite didn't know what they were giving. Now, those of you who are already YouTube members, five of you voted, and looks like you guys are a smart group because you guys all got the answer right, 7.5 grams. So how do we make this simple? Well, you literally take the number in front of the D, so dextrose 5, dextrose 10, dextrose 20, and you put that in 100 mLs. So if you take 5 grams of glucose and you put that in 100 mLs, that's 5%. If you take 10 and you put that in 100 mLs, that's 10%. If you take 20 and put that in 100 mLs, that's 20%, and so on and so forth. So then the question becomes is, how do I know how much glucose I'm giving? Well, if you know that you have five grams in 100 mLs and you're running at 100 mLs an hour, then you're giving five grams an hour of glucose. If you're running at 150 mLs per hour, which is what most people will start running their D5 at, you're giving 7.5 grams per hour. If you run at 200 mLs per hour, then you're giving 10 grams per hour. Now, when you switch over to D10, it's the same kind of concept. 50 mLs per hour is gonna basically be five grams per hour of glucose. 75 mLs per hour will give you the 7.5, and 100 mLs per hour will give you the 10 grams per hour. Now in rare cases, and I have had some cases where I've had to go up to D20, you can see that the math is exactly the same. 25 mLs per hour will give you five grams per hour 37.5 mLs per hour will give you 7.5 grams per hour, and 50 mLs per hour will give you 10 grams per hour. The math is much simpler this way. If you know exactly that number in front of the D and you put it into 100 mLs, based on the rate that you're running, then you know exactly how many grams of glucose that you're giving your patient. I recently published a Rebel Review card. It was Rebel Review number 107 on the Rebel EM website. That is exactly this slide right here and it tells you exactly so you don't have to crunch any numbers. If you're having to give your patient D5, D10, or D20, you know exactly how much glucose you're giving them depending on the rate that you're running the fluid. So there you have it, Rebel EM followers, D5, D10 versus D20 made simple. Leave me your thoughts, comments, and questions, and as always, thank you for following along. And to the people who are already members, we really do appreciate your support. Every bit counts and is helping us keep the Rebel EM website and podcast free. Until next time.